If you're concerned about it, it may be that that's a reason we should be flying over you. That was a statement made by a drone trade group rep when asked what he thought about people's concerns about the use of drones in the Constitution. There have been people who have lied about us. There have been people who have lied about me, national organizations who have lied about me. Some of that is in police training. The principle and chiefest of this lie is that our Constitution is a living, breathing document, that our founders invented liberty, that they had no idea what they were doing, and they were, I even heard one man say, winging it. You're not in trouble the day they refuse to issue the permit. You are in trouble the day that you psychologically accepted the idea that the government had the authority to give you the permit in the first place. The beauty of our system was that we had a partnership with internal checks, executive, legislative, judicial, and external checks. Because if men were angels, no government was necessary. If angels were to govern, Madison says, we wouldn't need internal and external checks. The reason the sheriff is the top cop is that he's the only cop that gets elected. He's the only one that's actually accountable to the people themselves directly. Do you know why we swear an oath of allegiance to the Constitution? Because the founding fathers required it. And they depended on our integrity and on our courage to keep our word and that we would absolutely lay down our lives before we would break our oath. I do not require the government's permission to exist. However, the government does require our permission to exist. The fact of the matter is they are there as usurpers. And you're the guys that can get that message across. You're the guys that can say the line is drawn here. I took an oath to protect the Constitution. You ain't in the Constitution. Stay out of my county. If every sheriff in this country, every lawman, everyone who's sworn out to defend the Constitution would simply do that, refuse to be a tool of oppression, we would restore our republic in a very peaceful manner right now. It just does not get any better than this. Any of you have a pen? Pull your pen out. We get to write the history of this moment. What's it going to look like?